Hello, investors and traders. This video will explain Special K indicator. More importantly, how you use this technical indicator in your investing or trading strategy. It is about learning how to put rules together to formulate a rule-based system. Some questions we will answer today is, what is the Special K indicator? how to use the Special K Indicator. What are our rules to trade the Special K Indicator? So before we get started, our catchphrase is, study it, analyze it, adapt it. What is the Special K Indicator? The Pring Special K is an indicator that was developed by Martin Pring to gauge momentum. It can be used to find the direction of the primary trend and to identify its turning points. Sometimes it leads these turning points. Sometimes it lags them. It can also be used to time shorter term trades or longer term trades. Pring Special K combines short term, intermediate, and long term time frames. Its calculation in the summation of 12 simple moving average, each with its own multiplier of special rate of changes calculations. Traders can plot trend lines on this indicator to find the turning points. The indicator is best used in combination with other analysis, indicators, and techniques. Price at any one time is influenced by the interaction of many different time cycles. The special, the special K indicator's momentum oscillator developed by Martin Pring to make rate of change readings easier for traders to interpret. A rate of change ROC indicator is the foundation of the special K indicator. Special K indicator is useful to identify major stock market cyclical junkles because its formula is weighted to be greatly influenced by the longer and more dominant time spans in order to better reflect the primary swings of the stock market cycle. The concept behind the oscillator is the price trends are determined by the interaction of many different time cycles and that important trend reversal takes place when a number of price trends are simultaneously changing direction. The special K is a momentum oscillator intended to the, interpret the rate of change of price data. Trading signals generated when the special K crosses over the signal line, but traders also look for overbought, overbought or overbought, oversold conditions. Traders also combine the special K indicator with other technical analysis to maximize their odds of successful trades. Special K indicator emulates the MACD indicator because it bases itself off momentum. So every time it crosses a specific, it could indicate a bearish or bullish move. The Special K indicator is a market indicator used to track market movements that may indicate buying or selling. How to use Special K indicator. The easiest way we analyze and understand the Special K indicator is the many different ways to use this indicator. Templates that can apply um, the indicator to any security with four years of historical data. As usually, one indicator does not make a strategy and should be coupled with other indicators and philosophies. This is absolutely true statement with the Special K where I find it most useful as a weight of evidence in the overall market and sectors, also with individual securities, but again, coupled with other indicators in a rule-based system. Any momentum indicators do not have a good percentage of winning to losing trades, but gives you evidence, reflects the best directions of market sectors or individual securities. How we use the special K. We are building a weight of evidence since we have run the Special K weekly, daily, and many other versions of the Special K by itself and has come up with poor results. But what has worked for us? I want you to start building in your head a weight of evidence. First, for the macro. Obviously, this is green, a positive Special K. And then, a red for a negative special K. So if you saw the spiders for the last two years, green, positive, and then recently red. 
but let's build weight of evidence. Let's go to the next one. Dow Jones, you're starting to see red now, where previously it was all green. Second evidence, building more. QQQs, all red, green running. So now we have in our head three separate issues that are building a weight of evidence just using right now the special K that we are going lower, but previously giving us a green light signal. We break it down even further into sectors. And now we're starting to see all red sectors. This one, consumer staples, a green one, a powerful sector, but still an overall top-down negative macro, not a good sign. Negative. Do you see how you're starting to build a weight of evidence? Okay, oil and gas exploration. This is another great example. In this market right now, as we speak, in 2022, we see the commodities and oil, oil services, oil companies, oil sectors moving up. So all the oil companies and oil sectors will have a positive special K and the rest will have negative. Again, consumer discretionary, starting to get negative. Healthcare, negative. Again, you are just building a weight of evidence. Utilities, negative. Real estate started to go negative. So all we're using is the special K to build a weight of evidence when we are in a bull market and a bear market. Let me show you on an Excel spreadsheet what I do every week to build a weight of evidence just using the special K. And we have over 50 indicators just off the macro. Here's an Excel spreadsheet. I wrote the stages on one side for the sectors. And then I wrote where the special K is given an indication. I want you to pay attention that the majority are in a bearish signal. Only US energy, a few consumer non-cyclicals and oil services are in a bullish stage with commodities. So now, if you see all this bearish, 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 special case, macro, bearish, 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 and we're just talking about the special case. If the majority of the sectors are bearish, which turns out to be about 86%, the probability this market is going lower. The few sectors that will do well oil services and commodities are the only ones that are bucking the trend through the special K. Now there are other indicators telling us that the oil services and um, commodities will do better and is good to invest in while it's telling us technology and growth companies will be a very difficult time, especially the three months. So even though the special K may not have a good individual probability is exceeding, it is giving you a weight of evidence that the market will either go bearish or bullish. Just so we give you a complete look, let's look at the daily special K. We plotted the QQQs to try to figure out a macro for the daily. We believe the KST, which we have reviewed in another video, is a better indicator with better crossing points, where the special K was supposed to smooth out the lines, we felt it has done the opposite. Again, we have found value in the special K by getting an overall trend and overall weight of the evidence, and we have found more value on the KST, which we have done a video, which the KST is the three indicators 
long term, short term, and medium term of the KST is the special K. Let's go to the next one. Here is another indicator for the special K. This is a weekly or what they call a long term special K. Again, we put in a long term KST on the bottom that shows better movements at highs and lows. The only value we possibly could see is at extreme highs and lows. Let's review. The best way to use the special K is in a weight of evidence in sectors and the overall markets. You can get a medium and long-term forecast with weekly tallies of ETFs and indexes. KST is better than the special K for short-term trading and easier to make a rule-based system. Overall, all indicators and oscillators must be coupled with other indicators. For further explanations, watch our videos on KST, No Sure Thing, Indicator, MACD Explain, and Top Down Strategy Explain. Please subscribe and turn on notifications for our weekly updates on the stock market and cryptocurrencies. You know what I'm going to say. Study it. Analyze it. Adapt it. Peace.